This video describes the types of contour plots available in Stack Graphics 18. Contour plots are commonly used to display response surfaces. One common format is lines of equal altitude. In this plot, you see strength as a function of ceiling temperature and cooling bar temperature. All points along a particular line give the same value of strength. In Stack Graphics 18, each line is labeled with the height of the surface. A second common format uses a palette of colors to represent the height. Here, blue represents low values of strength, while red represents regions with high strength. It's also possible to draw the surface in three dimensions and to draw the contours on the surface. You can even draw a solid surface and put the contours below. In Stack Graphics 18, contour plots are built directly into several procedures. Here, for example, is output from the DOE wizard. You see Pareto charts, means plots, and down here, a contour plot. One other type of contour plot is also quite interesting. If I press my right mouse button and go to pane options, I can change from a two-dimensional contour plot to a three-dimensional contour plot. It's now plotting contours of strength with respect to three variables, ceiling temperature, cooling bar temperature, and polyethylene. You see a contour plot here on the top surface, another contour plot on the front surface, and it's also possible sometimes to have a contour plot on the side surface. If I want to explore this three-dimensional contour plot, it's useful to go to the Analysis Toolbar and press the Explore button. This brings up a dialog box with certain controls. The controls allow me to change the values of ceiling temperature, cooling bar temperature, and polyethylene. Particularly interesting is to change the value of polyethylene because now you can see what the contour plot looks like as I cut different slices through my cube. You can also ask it to find the maximum value of strength within that cube by pushing the button labeled Ascent. Now it will slowly follow the path of steepest ascent until it finds the maximum location of strength in that three-dimensional space. Contour plots are a great tool for visualizing estimated models once you've fit them to your data. 